Hi everyone, I'm Josh from Avano, and today I'm going to be running through the functionality of our switch unit. The unit has three different setups for the top and arguably the defining feature is the pull-out drawer here. So to pull the drawer out, it's just a case of lifting both these thumb latches here, pull it all the way out and it will lock in the outmost position. The drawer is good for 180 kilograms, so it is suitable for tradespeople, tools, camping, any scenario really. To release there, pull the latches back up and push back in. You'll notice in this setup, this is the narrow unit and we have a cubby hole down the side here. This is good for surfboards, ladders, fishing rods, kind of a range of longer items that you wouldn't get in the XL drawer. We also sell a dog crate that goes in here, suitable for small to medium dogs, entirely toolless to install and remove and takes about two minutes. Beyond the drawer, we've got a, a rear flap at the back here. This is purely for quick access to, for anything in the drawer or down the side here. On from there, we've got two legs. These legs have got a dual purpose. First and foremost, they become the supports for your bed. Should you decide to remove the seats or if you've got a panel van and haven't got any seats at all. The combination of the legs will work for any configuration of the seats. So you can take one out, you can take two out, take all of them out and it'll still work. So the secondary function is that they've got a very gradual taper on them. So when you push them through and store them in this position, they push these double knuckle hinges onto full extension and therefore reduce any possibility of rattling. And from there, I'll take you around the side. So to pull the bed out now, it's just a case of giving it a little lift and slide out. So pull on out and your bed is made. So the bed here is in a short wheelbase is 1900 long, which allows a full full size double mattress. You'll see in this setup, I've got the two seats in here with a plus one removed, in which case I would use one of the legs to support the, uh, the unsupported side. If I were to have a three seat bench in here, it would just rest on the back with no legs. And if I had no seats at all, I would have both legs in. To get it up into the full bulkhead mode, I would just lean in now and give it a little break at the top and then a lift and slide. With the bulkhead up like that, I'll just hold it up and the line here, which is draped behind the backs of the combi seats usually, just goes into this little notch and into the opposite side of the cleat. Same again on the other side. Pull down through the cleat to tighten this up. And that is the bulkhead up. Although it looks particularly elegant, it's good for 350 kilos. To release that, it's just a case of pulling the line out of each side, dropping back down and then leaning in and giving it a little lift from the handle there and pushing back so that it sits in a little housing. And that is essentially all of the functionality of the switch unit covered. If you've got any other questions or need any information on any of our products, visit ovano.co.uk.